fucking fucked up guy is kind of dead, but I feel like he, there's still plans that he has going in place. Oh, uh, the the brain dance guy, or uh, yeah, the brain dance guy. Yeah, it's it's definitely not upset to see him take a needle to the throat. That's for sure. Oh yeah, but I don't feel like it's the last we're gonna hear of him, even though he's dead. Yeah, I mean he is the one who's got the connections for all the brain dances, so it makes sense <laughs> that he would pop up again. Yeah. All right. Episode six, Girl on Fire. Katniss Everdeen? <laughs> Be surprised if it's a reference, considering the nerds that made this. We want to skip the intro this time? Sure. I feel like we've seen it enough at this point. No worries. Damn, Han. Look familiar? Probably once it zooms out. I didn't mean zoom out that far, but okay. Careful what you ask for. You know, yeah, fair enough. I did. Damn. Pre swole Maine is. He was pretty good looking even before he went swole. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, Maine. He's going cyber spiko. So, this is what it looks like to dive? Yeah, this is what it looks like on Kiwi and Lucy's side of things while they're on the net side of things. Oh, no. He's going cyber spiko. Yeah. Maine punched her out. She ran into some ice that snagged her and he lost it. Sounds to me like Maine needs to get his head checked. Mm. Easy, Maine. Next time you start losing it. Did? Because that's the line. You can back off. You can de-rig and de-chrome. Don't even have to do it fully. You just have to back off. Mom, dad hit me. Seriously. Dad's going crazy. Pride is the ruin of so many good men. I believe in you, Lucy. Fine, I'll do it. What? But David has to come with me. Huh? And Maine, he can't be in the room. My condition. Take it or leave it. Fine, whatever. But you have to keep us in the loop. Ping us every quarter hour. You've got till dawn. Don't fuck this up. David, where's the lead head? Oh, hell if I know. Less hot. Hot. David. Yeah? I'm going in. But there's a trap here. There's gotta be a way to get inside. You got this, Lucy. Our girl's got this. What you want? And Kiwi. You can do it without her. How talked. You're willing to bet everything on a backup runner. The glitch vision is terrifying. A little bit. David. Oh, now he gets to decide which path he wants to walk. Yep. Literally getting the corporate life offer to him on a silver platter if he wants it. Comfortable living or fucking girlfriend and <laughs> pussy and sticking it to the man. Personally, give me freedom. I tried corpo life. It sucks. Fair. So, so I just got to mention this because I find it kind of funny. The other day I was having a conversation with my sister about the fact that I apologize way too much. But not only do I apologize way too much, but instead of saying I'm sorry, I have a tendency to say I apologize, like, literally. Yeah. And and she's like, why do you do that? And I'm like, because it's professional. And she's like, oh, right. You used to be a corpo. I'm like, but what? what's that? And she's like, corpo. That's why all your everything you say sounds like you're gaslighting people. It's because you're used to working with corporations. She said it like that. And she's like, yeah, I know you. So I know you're not trying to gaslight me, but you talk like a corpo. So you just sound like you're gaslighting everybody. Oh, my God. And I'm like, oh. Oh, my heart. So so I am working on the apologize thing, but but I thought relevant, relevant story. Yeah, very, very much so. All right. Uh, back to back to deciding between the corpo life and the, the runner life. I want to start talking. The fuck was you thinking? Not going to lie. You kind of deserved that one. Yep. He got her something to cover up. Oh, what a gentleman. Because you fucked up, David. Yeah. Damn, she got dressed quickly. I mean, it is a one piece. Yeah, that's a pretty skin tight suit. And she was just in ice cold water. You ever try and put latex on after getting in water or just put latex on in general? To be fair, cephalopods don't look very good in latex. Fair. You ever shove an oct octopus into a latex skirt? It's not exactly a pretty sight. You know, makes sense. Your point, however, is taken. Glass shattering sounds, that's my heart. Don't worry, I'm a cephalopod. I have a bunch more. No, shit. Not much comfort, but at least he wasn't the one who got her. Yeah. Because when I first watched it, I thought for sure he was the one that, like... That's what I was really fucking worried about. Yeah, like, you could still say it's his fault for distracting her during the combat, but that's different than being the one to pull the trigger. He's going out with a bang, at least. Yep. Oh, he's scary in psychosis. Yep. Time to call in Max Tech. You know that one? Yeah. Rips the pistol. Oof. David, you read me? Maine's gone full psycho. You've called in Max Tech. Turn around. Come back. The last thing I can do for her. We got 
got a Delta, or we end up like her. No more running for me, dog. Reaper's finally calling my name. Huh? He's got some sense? He at least knows that he's lost touch with reality. Yeah, David. There's no saving him. Sorry, little guy. Man. Oh, man. That dead-eyed stare. Yeah. He knew he was over. Shit, dude. Lucy ain't looking so hot. David's alive. But, uh... Me, not so much. Or Dorio. Or Kiwi. Or Mr. Grabby Hands. Tyler. He was alive, just, just main beat the crap out of her, so... Falco had to take her home. Oh, I think Kiwi's out, out of the business, at least. For a while. Man, that's still frame at the end there, though. Yeah. So anyway, let's go next. <laughs> you just want to keep it rolling, huh? Yeah, I I want it. I don't like cliffhangers. I don't like cliffhangers. I just binge a show and then I have nothing to watch. But at least I didn't get stuck on a cliffhanger. <laughs> I'm actually totally okay because I tend to be the same way, honestly. Oh, shit. She's back. Is this a newbie? Yeah. Yee. So David got his arms. Yep. He bulked up so he could have Maine's arms. Damn. He's growing up. My little baby boy's turning into a criminal mastermind. Oh he's a man. Oh my god, he's so fucking swole now. What the fuck? Where's Lucy? She is not currently here. Oh wait, did she get- did Rebecca get her brother's hands? And dye them red and black? And blue, I think, but yes. Or yeah, red and blue, I meant. Damn, that little psycho. All I can say is, is waifu forever. She gives major jinx vibes. Yeah, but I do come from the Spike Seagal a school of, I love a woman who can kick my ass. So. Ooh, big boy. Oh, buddy, you don't know who you're fucking with. Animation style is so nice, especially to show him in super speed. Yeah, I friggin' love the uh, after image style with everything else. Yeah, absolutely. He said, don't run ahead. The one rule, you had one job. This lovely old lady is one of the fixers you can get jobs from in the game, too. Gotcha. He still got his gun bug, though. Now she's showing off with the hands like her brother did. You catch this voice? He sounds like um, Cole Cassidy from Overwatch. That's because it's Matt Mercer. God damn it. He's grown up so much. I'm so excited for him as Ganondorf, by the way. He's gonna be Ganon! Oh, did you not hear? Pause for momentary squee that's about to happen. Yeah, he uh, he announced that um, with the new trailer, he's been given permission to confirm that he's Ganondorf for the new game. Oh yeah, fuck yeah, holy shit. And and they uh, they they released a picture of, of the art for 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 Ganondorf. Oh, I saw the art. I saw the art. Yeah, with Matt Mercer's trademark uh, bass baritone. Mm, yes, daddy. Daddy Ganondorf. Friendly guy. reminder, uh, audience, that Ganondorf is the bad guy, not the fuckable guy. And porn, he can be whatever you want, though. I, I would like to point out that these two things are not mutually separate. Considering <laughs> the amount of bad guys I chase, let's be fair. You know, fair enough. All right. All right. Back to right. the end. Not without the city's primus runner. Both know you don't mean me. It might have been nothing. He grew into his hairstyle even. Right. I love her. I want to buy the laser pop hip grind. Poor Rebecca. I appreciate that she understands exactly the situation she's in. A lot of Damn. chrome. Yeah. Is he? Holy shit. Note on that, by the way. He is one of the named baddies from the original cyberpunk verse. Ooh. So, like, you had, you know, all RPG systems have their, the big baddies of the world that are, like, their max mm -hmm. level will screw you up. That's Adam Smasher. He okay. was in the back of the book as the as the the thing you unleashed on your on your players when you wanted to make a point. Fair point. Uh, can we pause still for a little bit? I'm gonna grab a drink. Of course. I ran out. Refill too. <laughs> okay. What the fuck is going on here? Who's taking a piss in my ears right now? <laughs> Nothing to be concerned about, I'm sure. But no, no, never. Um, Someone else I watch was commenting on how nice it is when you've got a uh, opening that doesn't give things away for new viewers, but has lots of beautiful reminders for people who've seen it before. Yeah. So like I'm seeing all these flashing images and things and going, oh, that, that's that, 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 that. And it means nothing to you. Speaking of drinking. Mm -hmm. Sorry, ass lost calm by now. Thinking you're right. Whole thing reeks of high 
this shit. Wish Faraday'd tell us what the fuck we after. What's the saying? The biggest bitch is the one that got away. Should I dig deeper? This is a fixer's job. It's on him to give us a lead. As much say, I paid hey, cool. City, uh, the afterlife bar is out. I forgot about that part. They're wonderfully kinky. Seems like it. Close enough. But yeah, uh, Afterlife's the big bar in Night City if you're a cyber mm -hmm. boy. We'll find out soon if you're the shit or just another shit thing. Ours. You know, fair enough. That's the sketchiest shit that you can do, homie. <laughs> right? Like, could you fucking love Rebecca? Oh my god. 20 grand. Okay, I like her. Don't get your fucking panties in a twist, David. Don't forget what she did to you. Scabs are the worst. Oh shit. If I remember from the commentary, the commentary from the guards is supposed to be that they think she's a child. <laughs> so beat up. You know, I guess that's one way to keep the sweat off you at least. Actually, I kind of like that idea now that I think of it. I imagine it makes it a little bit harder because of like the water well, just makes everything and... slippier. Well, and also steam for heat and whatnot. It's... Yeah. Oh, boy. Didn't mean that came out wrong. You just meant your age, your skills, they don't add up. This is what happens when you net run and you place your mind and self into the cyberspace completely. Deserved. Yep. Oh, babies. Remember, it's always okay to tase people who are grabby. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. The brain dance club. Oh, my God. You gotta stop shaking. Can't do it. Oh, shit. Why we decided to put Rebecca in a fridge. <laughs> Thank you for removing her from the fridge. Thank you. Touch her baby girl. The moon. Special BD she had. You two went on a date to the moon? There we go. Oh, cool. Gotta be honest. I wouldn't mind swapping my lungs out. Yeah, same. Give me new legs. Give me longer legs. I mean, I your legs are pretty awesome. I want to be told. He's got a new upgrade. He's the one fucking pissing in my ear. How much piss does he have? Why does his dick look like that? Excuse me, homie. Homie. Comes the David. Oh, that's her fucking brother, too. Yeah. Oh, he's jammed. This guy's fucking psycho. That's why they're called cyber psychos. First kill. When the moment came time. Spoken. You too, kid. Stick with Lucy and Dorio. We'll tell the badges exactly what went down. Fuckers chromed up the wazoo. It'll be easy. Minimal questions. They'll file it as a cyber cycle incident and done. Yeah, but... You saw what you did back there, dog. It's high time you stopped thinking like a rookie. You again? You know I'm... Yeah. You really trust hand driving? I mean, he did teach him how to drive at this point. Hey! Hold on, I have a cat trying to steal my pizza. Get down! Nice. Damn it. You got your own food, David Haku. Yeah. You kind of were justifiably pissed off. Mm -hmm. Young love. So cute. Kiss me, baby, under the earth rise. So good so far. Yeah. How many episodes are there? 12, I believe. 12, yes. Okay. No, 10, 10. Oh, shit. So we're almost halfway there. Yeah, it's not a long series. It doesn't need to be. So, do you want to just go on to the next one or do you want to chat about this one? Let's just go on. Don't blame you. Let's go. Thank you, Bucky. Don't blame you. Yes, Haku. What? You want my pizza? No, you're not getting it. No. Stop looking at me like that. She's giving me the eyes. Oh, no. Not the, the eyes. eyes. And she's jumping up on my chair and just putting your little paws on it and just patting it. You fucking crackhead. Oh, goodness. There we go. Follow the laser. There you go. Here we go. All right. After they fuck. I gotta work on that poker face, dog. Give me some good news. God, zilch. Ooh, blue nipples. And the glow lines are f the glow line spider web tattoo is fun. Oh yeah. Hey hey. It's always thirst for the creepy shit. A lot of BD is seen by someone named J Just don't get edits like he's anywhere else. It's no wonder he's coming back for more. Well, I'll be damned. David's kinks. <laughs> Remember, folks, make sure your bodyguard is part of your polycule. <laughs> So fun note for what they're talking about. Delamain is mm -hmm. the automated taxi cab service in, in Night City. 
and notably they're all run by a a ai program named delamain who's the the ai through all the cars okay i gotcha yeah also delamain always gets you where you want to go safely and the more you pay delamain the stronger the car is gotcha gotcha Gotta love the purple pimp. Damn. Damn. I guess. I love those two. They are such a fun couple. Somebody. Just a little. Man. David's weak. Fuck. Another fucking BD. You think he's riding a BD right now? I hope so. Or a nightmare. Keyword, I hope. Yeah, he didn't have that. Yep. BD. I yep. call it it. Mm -hmm. With the limiters off. Most of them are whack jobs. But you're a real <laughs> cyberpunk, aren't you? What is it you're after? Attempting to ambush me like that? Clearly you've done your homework. Seen my other works, perhaps? Say the Edge Runner series? Stuff. Well. Flatter. Curiosity, wondering how I get my hands on so many cyber psycho scrolls. You see, all military prototypes come with a built in brain dance scroller. Some folks are willing to pay through the nose for that kind of material. Your Sandevistan, do you know who wore it originally? James Norris, that's who. All in all, Norris mowed down 27 people. Max Tech finally put an end to his killing streak. Oh, his own. Yeah. Someone who can go toe to toe with a psycho. Yeah, because normally brain dances have stuff to keep you from hurting yourself or from experiencing oh, ego death. Are you trying to force him to go psycho? Shit. She really wants to shoot you, man. I wouldn't. How is he? Can you get him out? I'm trying. Need a hand? Can it? Done. What a shame. So, how might I assist you fine people? Not here to kill. I am still alive. It's not off the table. Oh, damn it. Seems you're surrounded. Ready to throw in the towel yet? Mouth stay shut. Lucy, I'm working on it. Do your thing. I'll keep them busy. Whoosh. Okay. Everyone clear on the plan now. I'll be on the hollow. Till then, you stay put. Keep an eye on it. And I'll second out of the sight. I'd like to apologize for earlier. Sorry for driving you insane. Right. What makes you think you're any different? Dunno. It's tough to say. It just feels like it like it's always been a part of me i'm built different I just... i'm just built different it's such it's one of those this is a beautiful and important line but god does it sound cringe when you say it out loud it's such a meme simply not meant to be. your soul gets pushed to the air teeters on the brink and it always ends one of two ways you either lose yourself forever or die What's so special about that one? That's the one that he was watching, wasn't it? Yeah, the one before him. How about that? So unfortunate. I'm rather proud of how this one turned out. A true waste to settle for standard. The sensitivity, the real feel is... Mr. Kurosaki, my patience is running thin. Unfortunate is right. Yeah, would have made our job a whole lot easier with you chin deep and beady titties. And who are you? Don't try nothing. Arrogance. I really am. Do you have any idea who I am? Forget about your panic button. We've got a jammer up. Damn, get fucked. Ooh. You know I me, mean? I don't think you want those arms no more. They, they ain't working half the time. Right. Knockout. Oh, shit. He's going to stare right at him. No. It was so fucking creepy. I will give them this. I do appreciate the fact that trauma does come in with the expectation that they're gonna have to protect people. Yeah. Like, nope, we're coming in full armored. We work in Night City, we know how this functions. Halfway through already, holy shit. It goes so fast. It is, well, the episodes are only 27 minutes long and like 10 minutes of that is credits, I feel. True, true. But it still just feels really fast because it's mm -hmm, very mm -hmm. quick paced. 